So this is the follow-up video to uh, compiling a .NET application using this UI framework to display a GUI application that was written in .NET with C Sharp, or was written in C Sharp using .NET tooling, .NET Core tooling on a Raspberry on a Raspberry Pi running Raspbian. The question is: Is can the app run quicker, more performant without um, slow? And I had compiled a debug release and then compiled a release release of the same app and they both perform equally poor. So to show, this is the same app that I compiled for first using the debug and this is the release. So let me start the release. Okay, so that's a common error that I was describing in a prior video. To get around this, um, that's nothing related. That's a setup setting issue that I um, haven't adjusted yet. So let me uh, let's do this real quick. Code .net apps. There's a GUI. So this right here, without the release, is the debug build. But in the release, I went back into the Windows uh, virtual machine and you use this configuration flag. Uh, and it did, in fact, build a release because it was in the release folder when I finished building it. And a difference is, is that it doesn't create a publish folder when you use this uh, release. It just creates the, the Linux ARM folder and it put all these files from the Linux ARM folder. And then so I just tar -G -G tarred gzipped it and sent it over to my Raspberry Pi from the virtual machine and then chmod the file and then run the app. Those are common. Um, I could probably install the SWRAST and as you can see it's loading. It usually gets about that far and then about several seconds later several tens of seconds later, it will continue filling in the uh, dark spots of this window, black spots with the white frame. And there it goes. So my question for you guys that work on this UI framework here, is there a way to make this quote unquote desktop.net app more performance so it could be usable for me for when I start working on porting this app. Any help with that would be appreciated. Thank you.